we're going to bring someone up from the audience uh, to uh, help us out uh, with a little something. Oh, here she is. Um, uh, this would Good to be, be recognized by Tom. She has to wear something uh, with Michigan on it. Yeah. So she's uh, got that all squared away. Oh, it's uh, Lake Erie, Michigan. Yes. Okay. I didn't realize Lake Erie touched Michigan. Is that a fact? Yeah. All right. <clears throat> Uh, Huron, here. Oh, I guess it does, yeah. Uh, and this, this, this must be uh, Sydney. Is it a hard G? Gendron. Gendron. Yeah. A soft G. Sydney Gendron has joined us. Hello. Hi, Sydney. Sydney. How are you? Yeah, I'm good. That's how a scream reference. Good. She's what now? Oh, I, I made a scream reference. Hello, Sydney. Oh, oh, oh. I thought you said she's fragrant. Um, how no, not that I can tell. From, yeah, no. Uh, yeah. Lean over. Give her a good whiff. I uh, wouldn't do that to Sydney. She's a, fun, a nice person. Uh, well, do you want me to come over? Uh, I, I try not, no, sit down. I try not to smell anybody at a state fair. Yeah, that's a, that's a good idea. Um, are, do you wear perfume? I do. Do you know the name of it? The one I'm wearing today is, I mix it up. Um, today I think it's Daisy, uh, Mark Jacobs. Oh, oh, nice. Daisy is the name of the perfume? Yes. Mm -hmm. So is it floral? Or does it yes. smell like Mr. Jacobs? <laughs> Just Wait. do the bit. Great questions, Tom. Uh, Sydney, do you have any tattoos? It's been kind of a theme today. I do. I have nine tattoos. Nine? Oh, oh. I do. Can we, uh, are any of them visible to the, uh, without yeah. going into the naughty areas? Uh, Oh, it looks How like, do you know she has them on her naughty area? I just, I didn't, I'm you just... You were assuming. Is that an, uh, there's one on her leg right here. Yeah. Is that an angel or Tinkerbell or... It's kind of like a, a little fairy mm. type. Some of mine have meaning and some of them don't just because, mm -hmm. it just depends. But yeah, I have a huge back tattoo that goes all the way, all the way down my back. Oh, he's fascinated now. Where does it end? Lower back where you would... Her b-hole, Tom. Is that what you want to hear? <laughs> Is that what you want to hear? <laughs> <I'm curious. laughs> Do you feel like you're being, uh, you guys, this is not a hostage situation. You can leave. It's yeah, fine. Yeah, it's yeah, go okay. ride some rides. Yeah, I mean, let, him, let him sit Sid here by himself. Sydney, the one on, your, on, the, on the back of your back, mm -hmm. the back, is it um, uh, like an art piece? It's a huge long flower with um, two butterflies, and one of the butterflies sits on my spine. Oh, that was very painful. Oh, I bet. Yeah, yeah. Wow. not good. Is it colorful? No, I have, the only color I have is right here, a little red one, and then I have red Libra on my ribs. Okay, now I notice you have a piercing in your nose. I know, and I ears. heard that you don't like nose no, piercings. No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. He said it. Can you, I have a question. Girl when you have face. a cold, can you block the nostrils and blow, and does it shoot out the hole? It does not. Oh, no. Because okay. no. that'd be cool. Yeah, it doesn't do that, but. <laughs> that'd be funny. You can't talk to people. Oh, <laughs> no. Sorry. I was really, so excited. Really I was can't. ready for all these questions. Oh, you, <laughs> you were. You did your homework. Right? Nose ring, tattoos, all the questions. Are those your only piercings? Yeah, and I, well, I have uh, three. I have ears. Okay, that's it. Yeah. I, I, and I'm not, uh, well, Stop. early, no. Stop. Stop. I'll, Stop. I'll do it, so, so I'll do it Socratic method. Zip. Christy Lee, did we have a, something about piercings in the news earlier this week? Yes, we did. What was it? Um, some nipple rings were stolen from a Tacoma uh, Washington uh, sex shop. No, it was a piercing store, actually. Tattoo and piercing shop. How many uh, people here, by applause, have nipple rings, other than the band? Okay, well, um, two. Was that I, I want to, I it's stated for the record that Christy's husband clapped. <laughs> <laughs> and Jeff Oskay. And Jeff Oskay. Ah, <laughs> oh, you knuckleheads. Do you, do you have the nipple ring on right now, Jeff? No, oh, okay. <laughs> I know what to get you for Christmas now. Oh, gosh. All right. A little sculpture of me. <laughs> <laughs> like a little bar relief of me dangling from his uh, nipple. Oh. Well, uh, um, uh, Sydney, we've asked you to come up here to help us um, do a little piece that's kind of about the fair. Okay. And have you been given your script over there? I have. Okay, well, um, is there, everybody has their parts. I think we're ready. All right. Uh, and if, it, if, if I'm not mistaken, uh, 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 Sydney, you kick this off. You're portraying Lady. Got it. Okay. So good. Got it. <laughs> Do it nice and loud. We're ready when you are. Go ahead. Okay. Hurry up and wash for dinner, Billy. We're having your favorites. Sloppy Joe's, corn on the cob, and chocolate fudge cake. Oh, Mom, that stuff blows. 
Why can't we have fried dough or elephant ears like when the state fair's in town? I've told you before, Billy, making state fair food requires special equipment that I don't have here in the kitchen. We just can't make it at home. Now, hold on there, Mrs. Patowski. Thanks to the all-new Greasin' Art, you can enjoy your favorite state fair foods in the comfort of your own home. A greasy art? Yes! The good people at Frigamall Industries have designed a single appliance that prepares all the delicacies you normally associate with circuses, carnivals, counties, and state fairs. Just think, you can prepare fried dough, fried cheese, cheese on a stick, dough on a stick, corn dogs, dough dogs, fried dough poppers, fried weasel on a stick, and so much more right here at home. But how is that possible? The Grease and Art is a combination dough processor and deep fryer with hot grease fat and top mouth hot grease trays with built-in <laughs> grease injectors. The problem you have cooking at home is that you can get your grease hot, but not hot enough, not disfiguring hot anyway, and that's what sears in that special state fair flavor. Mommy, this corn dog burns, and it tastes like tattoos. <laughs> sure does, Billy. The smell of the Midway oozes out of every bite. It's perfect. But aren't all those foods deep fried and hot grease, grease awfully fattening? Just ask yourself this. Have you ever seen a fat carny? <laughs> hmm, now that you mention it, no. They all have a stringy drifters build with sharp rat-like features. <laughs> Yes, yes, they do. <laughs> and this product is 100% Carney tested and Carney approved. The same technology which Carney folk harnessed to become pioneers in the field of stick mounted foods is perfected in the Grease and Art. And the Grease and Art's handy size means it fits any kitchen. It's no bigger than freak show veteran Bugzo, the human torso, the famous legless, armless dwarf. And just look how little counter space he takes up. Right, Bugzo? Huh? Oh, yeah, right. Hey, I'm laying in something really sticky up here. <laughs> wow, he takes up almost no space at all on my kitchen shelves. Order Grease and Art today, and you'll win this giant stuffed dinosaur, not associated with Barney and Barney Enterprises Incorporated. Come on, what do you say? Nobody's a loser. Step right up. Give it a try. Hurry, hurry, take a chance. Gee, when I grow up, I want to be a carny. Why, wait, Billy, you can drop out of school and join now. I know they're looking for someone to comb the fleas out of Gaborah, the gorilla girl, and to, ah, and to sell bootleg cigarettes from the back of the ring toss game. Oh, boy. Can I, Mom? Please, can I? I guess it'll be all right. <laughs> you just be sure to eat all of your deep-fried vegetables on a stick and do whatever the carnies tell you to do. Come on, Billy. I'll drive you over myself. We just have one quick stop. Have you ever shoplifted porno magazines <laughs> while the <laughs> liquor store clerk is being distracted, Billy? Not yet, I haven't. The <laughs> Grease and Art, available now from Frigamall Industries or wherever carnies congregate. Thank you very much. Great job, Sydney. Sydney, everybody. Hey. Very, very good. Please tell me you're not a carny. <laughs> well, uh, thank you, Sydney. 